Bet you're glad to see these again. Photo radar cameras are back up, and there's still a lot of confusion about what you do if you get a ticket. Richard writes, he got one from Paradise Valley. It asks, what is the rule, and should I pay the ticket? Sharon in Peoria says, are the photo radar tickets from El Mirage legal? If I get a ticket, I usually pay it or go to a defensive driving school online. But photo radar, we're getting a lot of questions about whether or not you should pay it. It absolutely is legal. But attorney Robert Gruler says that doesn't mean you have to pay. One of the first lines of defenses is to say, I'm not going to incriminate myself. He says most people do what the ticket says you must do. Either pay the fine, say you weren't driving, request a hearing, or attend defensive driving school. But what they don't tell you on that piece of paper is that you don't have to do anything with that ticket. Huh? I'm going to wait until the court meets their burden, until they cross that hurdle and establishes jurisdiction. Or your right to due process. State law says you must be personally served within 90 days of the citation filing. Once a time limit expires, the court no longer can serve you. Gruler says he rarely sees cities go out of their way to serve photo radar tickets, except for Mesa and especially Scottsdale. They use a process server or they ask for permission from the court to do alternative service. Meaning the judge okays service by certified mail and a summons taped to your door. If that happens, you really want to respond. Otherwise, they're going to suspend your license and, and enter a default judgment against you. And about that camera on US 16 El Mirage, there's a new law banning cities from putting these cameras on state highways. So it's going down, but I'm told the tickets outstanding remain. Go to ABC15.com, click on sections and let Joe know to see all the ways to protect your money. Need my help? Like the Let Joe Know Facebook page, tell me about it there, or you can call or email me. I'm investigator Joe Ducey. If you've got a problem, let me know.